<clears throat> All right, I'm just gonna riff. I'm just gonna riff. It'll look good. Okay. All right. Hi. Hello. It's Harold. Uh, in this lockdown time. So it's been a bit of time on lockdown now. It's been feeling a bit like summer holiday. No one's really got anywhere to go or anything to do. Uh, gyms have been closed since like last Friday. So this is where I've been spending all of my time. Usually this little flat is paid for me, uh, but spending all day, every day here for the most part, uh, is quite a lot to handle. So I feel like I need to find something to do. There's only really this little bed over here for me to hang out. There's not even really any tables or any chairs for me to sit on. Uh, which isn't great for motivation and doing stuff or productivity or I can't even hang out in the gym and try crack on with something so I feel like I need to get out and give myself a little bit of a project so one of the big things that people have that they're struggling with is obviously not being able to go to the gym and keep their usual routine so I figured I'm gonna go to my my parents place and they've got their own little gym setup that they they made once upon a time uh, which I don't think they ever really use. So we go over there and see what damage is. We're gonna go and see what's what's been done to it, see if it's even usable anymore. Uh, and we're gonna try to set up a little home gym for, for us to use and hopefully for my parents to use. I think my dad's working from home now as well, so that'll give him something to do. That'd be quite nice. So hopefully it's not too bad. We'll check it out and see what's going on. All right, so let's go.
Right, so we're back home. So hopefully you guys enjoyed that little setup video that we just made. Uh, it was quite quite a mission to get that sorted, but we're glad we did. All the equipment was a lot better than I thought it would be. A little bit rusty on some of the equipment, but again, for the most part, more than capable of sorting out a little workout. Again, very grateful that we do have a bit more of an option. Some people have to stay at home and use their bands and two kilo kettlebells. I'm gonna be honest, it's been a few weeks now. Yeah, a lot has changed in the meantime. Um, this quarantine's actually been extended for a few more weeks, so uh, even better, I guess. In all honesty, it's been quite quite a nice lockdown. We couldn't really ask for better weather. It's been sunny almost every single day. It's been very nice to get outside with loads of people on their bikes, walking around, um, going to the parks, which I know everyone should be doing their best to stay safe and stay away from people, but still nice to see everyone uh, getting outside. If you do follow me on my Instagram, you've probably seen what we've been up to. We've been doing a couple of workouts. We've been inside, we've been doing some in the park, got some gymnastics rings, did some tumbling in the garden. Just again, trying to make the most out of what we can. I know we do have that home gym where we can obviously lift heavy weights, which I, do, which I would usually do. Um, but again, just take it as an opportunity to do whatever you want to do. Not everything has to be optimal all the time. And on that note, I want to talk about for anyone who is struggling to get their workouts in or probably not pushing themselves to the, the extent of what they think they should be doing in this time. Um, one of the big things to remember, I think it's been said before, but it's not, this quarantine is not a productivity test. It's not for everyone to see how much work they can get done in X amount of weeks. It's, it's to stay safe. It's to make sure uh, the least impact can happen for what, what's going on, which is obviously quite unprecedented, but and it's you don't owe it to anyone to keep as busy as possible obviously we don't want to encourage people to do nothing and waste their time and um, by the end of the day you don't have to force yourself to do stuff you might not be in a position to do shut up but not everyone's in a position to uh kill it and learn a new skill and do a uh, kill it uh, learn a new skill keep themselves busy the whole time and go for balls to the wall exercises every single workout. If you're one of those people that never takes a break and this is finally a kind of forced holiday where you basically get paid, uh, sometimes it's best to just take it. If you just take it to chill out, come back fresh, it's even better. So the answer isn't always to be keeping busy and moving, it's just being honest with what your needs and what your goals are, I guess. Obviously, if you can, this is a, a strange time where everyone has a lot of time off to do what they want to do. So if you can use it for something special, go for it. If you want to learn something new, if you want to keep yourself busy, go for it. It's awesome, fantastic time to do it, but don't feel like you have to, that's all. For some people, it's just a good time to work on something that maybe you didn't have time to work on before. And if I'm completely honest with myself as well, I don't think I've been as busy as I probably could have been. There's been more than enough days where I've just spent it all day inside, uh, eating food, chilling out, watching Netflix, uh, which means nothing got done. But I loved it. It was cool. It was nice. It was really good to just switch off for a little bit. Uh, and the worst thing you could do is regret it because what else are you going to do? You can't, you can't take it back. So what's next, basically? I think for the next few weeks, I'm gonna see about making some workout videos and showing you guys what I do for the most part, going a bit more in depth on what I suggest people would do in a given situation. I've been kind of staying away from suggesting workouts and performances for people because I think it's just, there's been more than enough of that on social media. And people are far better than me in body weight or in hit workouts. I've posted a thousand videos, so have a gander, have a go and have a look at what they're doing. Um, but for me, I like using the heavy weights and that's that's what I would like to stick to. So rather than telling people what I do without them, I just say, do what you can, have some fun, see what other people are doing, enjoy yourself. But for the most part, that's it. There's nothing for me to say. I think that's it for the video. So hope you guys enjoyed seeing us setting up the gym. Hope you guys enjoyed seeing a little bit of a workout. We'll probably post some more in the near future. And um, if you liked it, you know, give us a like, give us a subscribe, see what's going on. And other than that, just stay safe, have fun, chill out. Much love. See ya.